In tonight's Tech Minute, iPad mania has taken over the country. Today, Apple released its new iPad and had fans lined up outside Apple stores everywhere from Germany to Tokyo and, of course, here in South Florida. At the crack of dawn this morning, Apple lovers waited to be the first in line when the doors opened. So what are they saying about the new iPad? Does it live up to the hype? Here's CBS 4's Kara Kostinich with more. Hi, guys. Hi. Welcome. As the Apple store on Lincoln Road opened for business Friday morning, Apple employees greeted every waiting customer. Good morning. Welcome. First in line, 13-year-old Sierra Callwood from Pembroke Pines. She can't wait to get her hands on the new generation iPad. So it's worth staying out all night for. Yeah, seven and a half hours now. By early dawn, Sierra was joined by a growing group of Apple addicts. Some coming far and wide for the new technology. I'm from Russia. We're from Oslo, Norway. We came from Germany to get it first because in Germany it's impossible to get it. And you see why Chris Rosbach flew all the way from Europe for the new iPad. Take a look at the line in Munich. He says it's practically impossible to get the tablet back home. And this was the scene in Tokyo and Hong Kong and even Sydney, all for first dibs on the new generation iPad. It's fun to buy it here. Our overseas friends also say the price is a lot less in the United States. Glad now to get it now, uh, to be one of the first people in the world to have it now. We came from Germany just to buy it here. And here in Miami, all the talk is about the new features like the sharper HD display, a faster processor, and an upgraded HD camera. I'm, I'm just fascinated with the retina display. The retina display, of course. The new iPad and the iPad 2 look very similar, but the bells and whistles of the new iPad definitely separate the two. For a closer look, head to your local Apple store or Apple retailer. They are officially on sale. On Lincoln Road, I'm Kara Kostinich, CBS 4 News.